Film crew from San Jose State is recreating a John Steinbeck story that is believed to be an inspiration for the classic novel Grapes of Wrath. Len Ramirez spent time with the cast and crew and gives us a behind the scenes look. Well, the crew has been working on this project all summer long, but for the last few days, they've been out here in rural Santa Clara County recreating this classic Steinbeck short story. Let's get quiet all around. All right, let's go. Quiet on set, please. And action. The San Jose State film crew is bringing John Steinbeck's breakfast back to life. This is a memory of John Steinbeck while he was writing news stories for San Francisco News about the migrant issues in California. The short story was written as Steinbeck's first person account of meeting up one morning with a struggling migrant family during the Great Depression. The family is happy because they found work and have food they're willing to share with a stranger. Everybody comes to this country, no matter where you're from, seek a better life. Brad Edwards, who plays the stranger, says the genius of Steinbeck is that even though the story came out 80 years ago, it could have been written about migrants today. Giving your kids a better chance than you had. And I think that's what it was about then. I think that's what it's about now. The story is believed to be one of Steinbeck's inspirations for his masterwork, The Grapes of Wrath. And he specifically used breakfast, this scene, in Grapes of Wrath uh, in the camps when they come to California. The professional cast also includes Spartan alum Matt McTie, whose credits include Get Shorty, Shameless, and Hawaii Five-0. You feel so proud of what you've created. The crew includes Spartan alums who now work in the industry and current students with dreams of getting there. My goal when I graduate is to go on to LA and produce and to one day hopefully direct. That is a wrap on breakfast. With shooting completed, Spartan Film Studios hopes to have a short ready for the film festival circuit. We'll send it to Cannes, to Sundance, everywhere. It will also become a free resource for students at the Steinbeck Center at San Jose State University. In San Jose, Len Ramirez, KPIX5.